Why, hello there. It has been a minute. Or like 10. Or like, you know, a couple months. How has... I literally... It, it feels so long, right? That like... <clears throat> I have a lot of my stream set up bound to one button. Like, I, I have it set to open up most of my programs, get everything set up in the window positions and stuff that I like. I hit that one button and I still felt like I didn't remember how setup goes. <laughs> Thank you for the sub, Jaika. 22 months. That's how long it feels like it's been since I last streamed. Also, why my mouth no move when I speak? Ah, ba 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 ba. Ah, ba ba ba. There we go. It's a little bit better. Welcome back. Glad to be back. Like, honestly, it... So, I stopped streaming for a long while, and the break was, in quotation marks, nice. It let me get a lot of other stuff done on the side. But also, like, the workload was kind of exhausting. And I still had, like, a lot of financial stress and stuff, as always. So it wasn't, like, the most break-like break I've ever had in my life. And honestly, I really missed this. It feels like it had just been way too long since the last time. Also, as you can see, uh, the sizes of everything are all off here. Uh, give me just a second to fix that. Part of the problem here is, is, uh, you see, I did an update to my tits. And that kind of led to every single setting I had wiping, which, uh, I must say, not, not my favorite event to have ever happened, you know? So I had to, before a stream today, redo everything I could. And it was just a lot. I don't even remember where. There it is. Okay. Now I should be able to tinker with the settings to my heart's content. Uh... Ba -ba -ba -ba. Hi, Safi. Hi, Rachel. I don't even remember how to mess with these settings. Did it... Ugh. You know? This one? It's this one. Okay. I think that's probably... Ah, close enough. Okay, so now... Let's, uh... Yeah, much better. I did it. I fixed it. I'm I'm a professional at this. Multiple years of experience, and I still have yet to have my first thought. Your poor laptop is dying? No! I swear, that laptop gives you problems all the time. It is very unfortunate. Also, let me see if I can bring my, uh... Whoop. I, uh, might have lost my headset settings there for a second. Uh. Nope, that's just no audio. That's not good. What happened? Headset, work with me, please. I think... Okay, wait, wait, I have an idea. I have an idea. This is... the scuff 
that you know and love and remember, isn't it? Is it Aisha that's, uh... It doesn't have sound settings. So I'm gonna close it real quick. Reopen it and hope that my headset isn't just, like, super dead. It shouldn't be dead. Still have the premium box setup from this game sitting on your shelf? Honestly, I wouldn't mind picking up physical copies of some of the Atelier games. I've only played a couple of them, but the ones that I have played are among my favorites. They're very good. Also, give me just a sec. I'm trying to mess with my microphone here to get it into a slightly better position. Uh, speaking of, how is audio before I continue on to, like, full stream here? Game audio might be a tiny bit quiet, I think, but right now it's on the menu, so... What is Atelier Aisha? So, Atelier is a very comfy series overall, um, where basically your goal is to make explosives and hurl them at the local wildlife. I, I mean, practice alchemy to help people. And they have very interesting crafting systems. Crafting is a very hefty part of the games. So I'll let the intro uh, video play here, because I actually, despite having it sitting there looping during setup, I didn't watch it. Um, but basically, each atelier has kind of three games, usually, in a specific world before they kind of move on to a new world. Hey, Avery, Avery. Hi, a hound. And basically, um, they change a little bit from game to game, but the core premise usually remains the same of largely you are an alchemist doing alchemist things. And this is one of the games that has the dreaded, most dreaded thing in all of video games, an actual time limit. Hiya, cat! But usually, um, Atelier is pretty generous with its time limits, at least in my experience. Like, it doesn't feel like it's too, too pressing. But the thing is, is on Sunday, most likely, there is a very special stream coming up. And the vibes that that stream has left me in a state where I couldn't help but have Atelier on the brain 24-7. So I decided that it was time to play some Atelier. So I'm probably actually going to be on these for a while because I want to do this one, the next one, and the final one in this trilogy all back to back. What extras do we have? Nothing yet. Oh, we have a model viewer. Cute. Library, that's me. Kind of. And I guess we also have the DLC. Uh, we can't do glasses. I am offended. How they can't make a game and not let me immediately put glasses on? All right, chat, chat, chat. Are we doing normal or hard? Keep in mind, I am rusty not only in streaming, but at video games. This controller has some dust on it. Normal for Aisha? All right, I will stick with normal. I'm excited. I haven't played an Atelier game in a while. Atelier Fierce was the last one that I played. And I didn't really like 100% it or anything. I sort of just completed it to complete it. Alright, so we've got Revolver Ocelot here. So, no success. I thought that perhaps 
this place but the decay is the same one thing that is very nice too about the atelier games is they tend to be very heavily voice acted which saves my poor voice some effort. I really want to do some point redeems, but I want to save up to make you go bedge. It's okay, I've actually been... Okay, I, I can't say I've been sleeping well lately, but I've been... the tiniest marginal bit better about it, kinda? He's kind of hot. Which one, Golius? Revolver Ocelot or uh, the blonde guy? Yes. So, tell I knew it. There are some Western peculiarities about the way you talk. I see. So you're familiar with it then? Revolver Ocelot. A little. I go there to trade. Yeah, maybe. So, um. I'm honestly not sure if all of the point redeems work. I had to redo most of them, too, to work with, like, the fixed setup. Ow. Okay. Ah. Ah. Okay. Okay. We, we've determined that that one works. Oh, BGM is on. Thank you, Safi. I, I, I knew that. I, I was just testing you all. I was testing you all to see if you remembered to gaslight me about my BGM. Ah. Leave it to Golius to get the good draw right immediately. I said that to be pretty rare. You don't hear Totsugeki. Um. It should be. Ow. Uh, let's see. No, you're so right. It's not capturing the audio. That's weird. Um, I am not sure why that's not capturing. Give me just a second here. Uh, you know what? No, that's not working. E hmm. Oh, wait, 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 no. That also wouldn't... What? I'm confusion. I, I don't... I don't get it. There's been hella OBS bugs these past couple weeks. They were waiting for me to return. They were like, we heard Avery's coming back. Prepare the scuff. Uh, let me see if I add a new audio capture source, if that will do it. Of course not. It's a bug, requires an OBS restart, so it's better to just pause the redeem. I refuse to restart. But also, um, I don't want to, like not have sound either. So give me just a second longer and I might be able to get this for you here. Eh? Eh? Can you hear now? Ow, ow. No? Dang it. Um. Huh. Application audio capture is what I had it on. We really are just right back here in the scuff, huh? There we go. Is that is that doing it? 
maybe? I did it! I fixed it! I just had to use a way worse setup for this and I'll forget that I set it up like this. There we go! We're back! Violence can be committed on me at will. But yeah, most of the redeems uh, I had to redo to match with the redone tits settings. And so, uh, you're basically in a position where you'll need to test them all by chucking things at my head. Anyway, we've got an atelier here That's in front true. of us. This place is plentiful. True. Huh? For the last few years, At least that was soft. Been calm and gentle. But some of the town's water veins have dried up, making it really tough to fill all my orders of grain. I also have um the soils probably like two pints of coffee here. So, so much I will be uh I will be well caffeinated through the stream. Sorry to bother you when you're so busy with your own. Business. You can't hit me with a go to sleep redeem on my return oh, stream. No. You can't do that. <laughs> that would be so mean. It's quite a ways to the next ruin, so please enjoy the ride. See over there? That ruin past the workshop is the one you're looking for. Ah, uh, all your emotes went through except for one, which happened to be part of a two part emote. That happened with, um these where for a while um it was one of the eyes didn't want to go through and it took a while my destination is actually that workshop it's a medicine shop that's run by a young girl hmm. a workshop in a place like this so it still does exist. I love the music in these games, by the way. Oh, you can drop me off right Like, here. the Atelier series has probably, like, top five OSTs huh? for me. Well, we're still pretty far from the ruin. That's fine. I prefer to walk there on my own two feet. And to those of you who will be uh, here it's on the Sunday feet. stream, especially those time, of you who will be participating, Get used to hearing a lot of Atelier music, because it is going to be used quite heavily through those streams. Scholar? Is that what I look like? Oh, I'm sorry if I was wrong. Since you're investigating the ruins... You're not far off. But I am... an alchemist. An alchemist in this? A game about alchemists? I don't believe it. Prove it. Blow something up with the power of alchemy right now. I played one of these once. I synthesized a barrel. Now, okay, okay. So, barrel is very important. Just, just keep barrels in the back of your mind. Is Aisha? Even today, she continues to make medicine by herself. Um, this and that. There we are. And mix it's us. To give it a nice Look at all those rinse. books. I approve. And... Wholeheartedly. Yep, looks good. When the liquid turns a golden color, then... I can't believe you did the joke before I did. Well, to both of you, look at the stream title. <laughs> that was a noise. When do we get to do real alchemy and make explosive gold? Uh, pretty- Oh my god, it's a baby! Here. Sorry for making you wait. I love them. Chew your food and eat slowly. It's not healthy to eat so fast. Okay. The sounds it makes are, uh, something, but they are still very baby. Uh, the sun feels so nice and warm. Maybe I should do the laundry. But before that, 
I'm hungry too. I've been so busy I forgot to eat. Hmm, this is Imagine good. being the person to voice that thing. I wish. Uh, casting companies, if you're out there and you need anybody to voice weird creatures, just let me know. I'll be on it in a second. Also, thank you for the sub fizz. Out and about, can't join, but welcome back. I am so glad to be back. Wheeled in the voice of that thing and that's it. That's the dream. Imagine getting paid to do that. It would be great. The leftover soup from yesterday? <laughs> What's wrong, Panna? I'm thinking uh, about what to eat. That so noise is so perfect. Uh. Oh, I'm still in the middle of a synthesis. It's a good thing I remembered. She left the cauldron on at home. I need to finish this before lunch. Okay, I'm just gonna combine it with lunch. Giant mouth Pokemon. Which one? Um, because there's a lot. Like, when I think giant mouth Pokemon, I usually think, uh, Exploud. Oh, uh, it's open! Come in! Oh, Guzzlord! Okay, so... Extremely non-controversial take. Guzzlord has the best voice acting in the entire Pokemon anime, hands down. It's not even close. Hello, Aisha. Oh, oh, this is. Oh, hello, Freddy. Ah, it's as smoky and smelly as always. I see. Ba -ba -ba. Eating while synthesizing just isn't proper. You don't know that, are you an alchemist, Ernie? What if eating while synthesizing is actually an incredibly important part of the process and you're here interrupting it? Alchemy is very delicate. You could cause this entire thing to go bottom up. Smoke and fire and bubbling cauldron goop could get everywhere. Are you sure you should be so calm about it? The voice actor that did the Guzzlord voice is called Shinichiro Miki and is quite known for his Pokemon screams. The Pokemon, like the Guzzlord scream, is literally just my favorite thing. It's so good. It may not look like it, but I'm seriously about to freak out. Hi, Alma. If I don't hurry, it'll be too late. Uh, how did you let it come to this? Well, also, I oh, ate right before a stream. I made myself a uh, veggie wrap. It was tasty. The secret ingredient anime girl toast? Uh, that's for a potion of haste. It makes you run faster. Before I knew it, a lot of smoke was coming out of the cauldron. Yummy? If you take one M out of that, you have my wife. You're right. Um, what was I doing before I gave Tana her food? I dropped in all the necessary ingredients. I'm listening to the Guzzlord scream when we have a bond on a spiritual level, he and I. Right. The I Guzzlord scream is my internal monologue. It's actually perfect. Now, to neutralize it for the next step, I need... Oh, where did I put it? Aisha, hurry! I don't think it's supposed to smell like this. It's still okay. This is perfect. Again, Ernie, what do you know? I'm just gonna eat one more. Hey, that's ill-mannered. I mean... No food can taste very good with this odor in the air. Well, go for our crew. Oh. Mm. Just a bit more. One more mm. stir should do. Mm. Swirl, swirl. There. <laughs> it's done. There. I finally got all the soot off. You can open your eyes now. You? Being covered with soot will spoil your cuteness. Jeez, you're always saying stuff like that. I mean, I'm pretty sure that he is incredibly wrong about that. Because, okay, okay, chat, chat. Back me up on this, right? Is, like, 
our chemists or engineer gals or like tinkers or stuff like that is the little smudge of like soot or grease or whatever like on their cheek or on the bridge of their nose not the cutest thing oh, um, here's the medicine order. like clearly he has no taste whatsoever One, the smudge two, is like three. the best yep, part it's all here thank you aisha oh actually i also have a favor to ask you really what is it well after i put in this order i got an additional order can i ask you for one more bottle sure if it's just one bottle it won't take that long either oh but i might need more ingredients okay i'm gonna go gather some outside real quick if it's soot then it's cute if it's engine oil, it might be hot. Alma, you might be onto something. Also, hi, Tia. I am doing pretty well. I can't blame him. He looks like the most vanilla guy ever. He really does, like... Ernie just has that look of, like, this is... This is anime guy. Like, you type in blonde anime guy into Google and he just comes up. Every song in this game is a bop. Turning his head too fast is already adventurous for him. Oh no. Ernie is going to be the uh, punching bag for the stream series, isn't he? Like, every song in this game is so good. This is one of my favorite, uh, like, indoor themes for stuff, too. I also really, unsurprisingly, adore, adore the library theme in Atelier Sophie. At any glowing spot, press A multiple times or hold it down to make Isha gather or bend down and start gathering. Time passes as you're gathering. Let go of or move away to stop. Also, when it stops glowing, you can't gather. However, the water from the well is unlimited and won't cause time to pass. You can check what you've gathered from the gather log on the bottom right. Returning to the workshop will move your gathered items to the container. The container can store a lot of items. All right, Aisha, we need to cook. Let's go. Also, look how cute this background is. Like, background? Backyard. Hmm, I wonder if this is enough. Ba, 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 ba. Sorry, I'd like to help you, but I'm not familiar with medicinal herbs or synthesis. Oh, so now you say you don't know what you're doing, Ernie, huh? Huh? <laughs> I'm used to this. Now that I have all the necessary ingredients, I'll hurry back and start synthesizing. We may as well gather some, uh... Mino, thank you for the sub! Owl has escaped containment. You'll never put me back in. I'm free. I'm free, you hear me? Until the medicine is ready. All right, now you'll get to see the core sort of premise of the gameplay right here. She is cringe and she is free. It's true. Hey, wait. Wait, wait. Cat? Cat? There's something we need to talk about. It is true, though. I am cringe, and I am free. So, 
we'll get an introduction to the crafting system here. Usually, um, all of the Atelier games have really robust crafting systems. And it's quite fun. So, to synthesize, select the necessary ingredients listed on the recipe. Recipes may require specific ingredients or ingredients from specific categories. For specific categories, you can select any item from that category. Your item's effect and quality also will change depending on the ingredients you selected. After selecting your ingredients, choose how many items you want to make. Days will elapse as you synthesize items. You can choose to put your synthesized items in your basket or store it in your container. When you want to use the container, open the menu in a town where you can synthesize. So we need medicinal herbs, oil, and roots. Is this okay? And synthesize. You can also just put the part of you that cringes in the timeout corner. I, I don't have a part of me that cringes. I legitimately think all open world games should just copy various Atelier crafting systems and just roll with that. Honestly, I do think that, like, more games should use Atelier-style crafting systems. They're so good. Yay! It's done! Like, especially later on. In the games when you're trying to like actually synthesize for specific traits and bonuses and stuff like that, you can just go really hard on crafting. It's done. Here you go, Ernie. I confirm the delivery. Thank you. You really saved me. Your medicine is very popular in town. Orders just keep coming in. The degree to which the uh, crafting systems are complicated in the Atelier game swaps from game to game. They do change them up. Oh, really? But <laughs> I'm so at least thus here. far in my experience of like three Atelier games, there hasn't been one that I have disliked the crafting the system of. Along with this. Oh, thank you so much. I'm sure she'll be happy too. Today is the day, right? I think Neo like this candy. Well, I've got to get going now. Say hi to Neo for me. Yep, you say hi to Bert too, Ernie. Oh, and one more thing. I think the ruin already had a visitor today. He's not from around here. He said something about investigating the ruin. Oh, a visitor? It's rare for someone to come to a remote place like this. Felt. Honestly, even with the complexity and the crafting, they're rather simple systems, which is what makes them fun, because you can just intuitively do them as you like. Yeah, that's the thing that I really like about them, is they're simple enough that you can kind of just pick them up, but also there's enough depth there that if you really, really want to, like, optimize your crafts and make, like, perfect gear and stuff, you have a lot of wiggle room to do that. Oh, there's a sprint button. That's kind of nice to have. And as you can see, we have our uh, journal here. I could just stand here and listen to the BGM all day. There are two modes of travel on the world map, standard mode and direct mode. In standard mode, use the D-pad to specify your path. It helps adjust your number of, number of travel days. In direct mode, use left stick to choose your destination. It helps take the shortest number of travel days. With either mode, press B while traveling to discontinue. Days will pass while, when traveling on the world map. If you travel randomly, your days will pass quickly, so be careful. Built by human hands and eventually abandoned, it is now Orb. a paradise. The plants, despite the course of human history, continued to expand their hold on this place. 
Of course, now is no different. The world maps are very cute. And I really like how they set up the environments and such in the Atelier games. I think they're just really well done. Arborbium. True. Oh, I can't go in that way. Can I go up on this one? No. Oh, right, yeah. Um, so, the Atelier trilogies, they're usually inspired by something. Uh, this specific trilogy was inspired by the Fallout games, of all things. And so, the world for uh, the setting is sort of in a state of decay a little bit. But, like... Much more in a, like, nature-reclaiming things Leo? sort of way. Sorry, I'm a little late. I came close to messing up the medicine I was synthesizing, so I had to clean up. Anna is it still so like baby. I can't do anything without you, Mio. Look, it's so pretty, just like that day. You liked these flowers, didn't you, Mio? Since you disappeared, it's been too... Um, three years. I I've been working ah, hard to get the workshop that dialogue. going. <laughs> <Are> <clears> you <throat> proud of me? Funnily enough, they didn't think Ryza would be well received by fans. How mistaken they were! Oh right, I brought a souvenir for you today. It's from Ernie. You liked this candy, right? Oh. And Ernie told me to tell you that he says hi. We need to thank him next time. The truth is, I still can't believe it. Neo, you came out to this ruin to gather medicinal herbs. But you never came back. I had everyone in town out looking for you. But all we found was your herb basket. Everyone said that you were spirited away. But I'm still not convinced. I've heard that these ruins sometimes swallow people up whole. I don't know. In my experience with fantasy stories, if you didn't see the body, then they're fine. And even if you did, they might get better. Why did I ask you to help me gather medicinal herbs? So, where do you go? Neil. <laughs> I love you, Pana. Well, Pana, let's go home. I have laundry to do. Gus was both cringe and free before being acquired by Koi Tecmo. After that, they still do their own thing, but the upper management mandated stuff is noticeable. Yeah, it's always tough when, like, you can definitely tell the thumb from above being kind of pushed down. Also, just a side note, all of the outfits in the, these games are always so on point. They're so cute. See, like, look at that outfit. It's so adorable. Dream, is it? Neo, well, where have you been this whole time? I've been worried sick about you. Oh. Well. She disappeared. Neo, where are you? 
she's Neo where to be found. Hmm. Owl real. Huh? H who are you? Step one to making an atelier protagonist, cute outfit. Step two, add silly hat. Step three usually seems to be, uh, in my experience, give them somebody they want to restore. <laughs> Thank you, Panna. <laughs> See, like, his outfit's really on point, too. There's no trace of it left. If it lasted a little longer, I could have analyzed it more. Oh well. I guess it would spoil all the fun if this was too easy. But then again, with a glowing flower and a glowing body, it's easy to make an educated guess. Panna is best moral, moral support animal. It's true. Uh, um, excuse me. What is it? As you can see, I'm very busy, delicious. So please don't talk to me. Um, but that's actually a grave. It's my little sister's. I have much inspiration from the series in my outfit too. Opted for a ribbon instead of a hat. Got to accessorize. That sounds to me like you just need a hat oh, at some please. point. Be gentle. Just, you know, add it on. Your little sister was a girl from moments before? Y yes. So you could see her too? Yes, parts of it. Your voice travels a vast distance. A very polite way of saying you were very loud. Oh, I just followed your voice. I didn't mean to intrude. Your sister seems to be in quite a predicament. To be living in such a state. This is the first time I've seen anything like that. Living? Does that mean that Neo is... safe? Is there any way to help her? Oh, and who are you? Who knows? I'm not obligated to tell you anything. Besides, I assume that you're the owner of that workshop, am I right? In that case, witch hat. Shouldn't you be able to come up with at least one? I need a witch outfit. That's what I need. I need a witch outfit. And I don't have any solutions. Hmm. That's odd. Then you're not an alchemist? An alchemist? What's that? Well, I'm an apothecary. I make medicine at my workshop. I'm sorry for asking so many questions all at once. Please, please tell me more about Neo. Hey, hey, put that out. Also, don't mysteriously light that with nothing in your hands. Then perhaps it's very likely. Listen, this is my fundamental philosophy. My fundamental philosophy is put the cigarette out, Keith. something that could be passed around by others. You yourself must demand and grasp them. If you want to know the truth, then you must study and think on your own. From what I can see, you are capable of that. I am? That's where I'm at. Wait, you mean I can think? I didn't think that I could think. Oh my goodness, I did it. Yes. I thought. However... It's not something you can blindly jump into. I shall give you two pieces of advice, though I have no obligation to do so. Take it as my apology for intruding. First, as a means to finding your sister, you must study alchemy. He looks like a pirate that'll become an evil dragon? Hmm. Where have I seen that specific character before? Hmm. I mean, it could be anything. So, what is alchemy? How do I... And second, this glowing flower. You must understand it. That is all. Your sister is somewhere you can't reach with your hands. In more than one game, I could say true, but uh, I don't, I don't know. 
Aizen still just can't place my finger on it, you know? With alchemy, there are a number of different ways to bring her back. This glowing flower. It doesn't look like a medicinal herb. What is it exactly? Don't ask me. Answer that question on your own. Well, farewell. Oh, please wait. I have a few more questions. <laughs> Yay! Thank you for the prime sub. You were 15 months reverse sober. I didn't expect to encounter alchemy in a place like this. However, that girl, in her current state, I'd say she has about three years. When am I going to play all of them, starting with Atelier Marie? That's a good question. I mean, I am going with these three. And maybe after I'll do the Mysterious Trilogy. Ooh, glowing flowers? Alchemy? I wonder if I can really trust him. This all happened so suddenly. I know. I should write it all down in a diary and organize everything. But first, I need to compose myself. What should I write first? I love that pen. My mobile data can't support 1080 streams, so I'll have to skip for now. Good luck with the game. Oh, is it not giving quality options? Because that would be unfortunate. Uh, with this system, you can use points to write in the diary. Writing entries can reward you with appropriate bonuses. Entries can be added by taking various actions in the game or spending time with other characters. You can obtain memory points in various ways. Try many things that may lead to more memories. For further information, please check the help section in the library. That's here. Where the help section? Why, why no Totsugeki? What happened? I'll just go like this until one hits me. <laughs> there we go. I did it. Why the Totsu no Geki? Ta-da! I went to the herb garden as usual when Neo suddenly appeared. She was exactly the same as back then. However, she soon disappeared. It seemed like she wanted to say something. Was it a spirit? Or an illusion? No, that was definitely the real Neo. I know it. I mean, I am her big sister after all. And one more thing. I met a spectacled man in front of Neo's grave. He seemed to know why Neo disappeared, but he wouldn't tell me any details. However, he told me to look into alchemy and glowing flowers and other things that I don't really understand before he left. But if those things are related to why Neo disappeared, then... No, if Neo is alive and out there in the world somewhere, then there's only one thing I can do. Okay, I've decided. I'll be out traveling. Please don't worry. Aisha. I wonder if this note is okay. I'm sure Ernie won't worry after reading this. Now I just need some ointment. Anna! Anna's got the drip. Yep, I'm ready to go. Neo is somewhere I can't reach with my hands, but she's still alive. I don't know how much of what that spectacle... Yeah, nobody will worry me. after reading that note. It's fine. But I should believe it all for now. First things first. Maybe I'll go visit the neighboring village. Someone there might know about glowing flowers. But what should I do after that? I've never traveled before. 
Very insightful, Anna. What is it? Yeah, you're right. I'll figure out the other things later. There are so many things I don't understand. But I have to get started. Neil? I love our silly pack animal. I will save you. So just wait for me. Okay, Panna. Let's go. Everything happening in this game is making me more and more excited for Sunday, too. They could have just sampled a cow and pig, but they didn't. They didn't. They did what they had to. The Sunday thing I am thoroughly excited for. Uh, the real question is, should I cover the Sunday thing now? Should I leave it as a surprise for Sunday? Or should I just cover it at like the end of stream is the real question. Hi, I can't believe I found someone else who plays this game. Uh, this is actually my first time playing this specific Atelier. I've played other ones. I've played uh, Sophie, I've played Fierce, and I played a tiny bit of Lydia and Suelle before uh, some other stuff got me distracted and then I just never got back to it. But I really, really want to get back to it at some point. But I figured for streaming, uh... It was between either the Mysterious or the Dusk trilogy, so I left it up to a poll and Dusk took it overwhelmingly. But I'm really excited to play all of them, especially um, one of my, because the Atelier games have some of my favorite soundtracks of all time, just in general. And the battle theme in Atelier Shally is incredible. And I'm so excited to get there and hear the most hardcore music for fighting just a tiny little puny. And yes, Sunday there will be another stream that is a little bit different from the usual course of things here. There we go. <laughs> the rainbow puny isn't a puny, it's the rainbow puny. Mm. It's different. After this valley is the next village. Just a little farther. I can do this. I can't wait until we get to make barrels. A little baby. Sorry, I'll just be leaving now. <laughs> My heart. Well, sadly, I need to go sleeping. Wish you a lot of fun playing, Avery. Thank you, Tia, and you rest well. I don't want to beat it up. Ba -da 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 -ba. Also, enemies near town aren't that strong, but as you reach more remote regions, stronger enemies will appear. Those enemies are formidable and won't be easy to defeat. To avoid wasting time and having your whole party get KO'd, prepare attack and heal items when you travel far. This one also has real good battle music. I'm just gonna let this play for a second. 
Because I want the uh, main rift to come in. Yeah! Also, more games need accordion in their soundtrack. Bonk! Ow! She's, she got to experience the true Avery Alexandria stream experience. No, no, uh, 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 uh. There we go. Finally something that hit me. I don't know why the Yidos are broken suddenly. They were working just a minute ago. We may as well gather on our way through here. Properly gathering while we're here means that, uh, potentially we will have less time to worry about later having to travel back to get specific materials. The track named The Beat Octopus, because I love that one. That one's really good as well, but I was particularly thinking of Scorpio. Before dusk settled over the world, no one even thinks about the vestiges. Look at how cool these towns are, too. Brimming with water. Even so, people cling to this land, vigorously living out their lives. <sighs> just a little farther. This is just me walking back to my house with the mountain that I live on. It is a bit of a hike. I would be terrified of falling off that town. Huh? Nah, it's Sometimes. fine. Just parry the hey, fall damage. Aisha. Long time no see. Regina, yeah, it's been a while. You've been all confined to your workshop lately. What's up? <laughs> Every time they put a new song and it's just a banger after banger. It's so... Mm, the soundtrack is just immaculate. It's the same in Sophie, it's the same in Furious. And I'm assuming it's going to be the same through all of these three, too. I was worried. Where are you going on your journey? I haven't decided yet, so my destination is on... Hydrate? I can do that. going to stay um i still need to figure that out going on a journey without knowing your destination you sure are doing something daring hey if you don't have a place to stay come to my house for the time being i want to know more about your journey i'm tied up right now with my job but i left the door unlocked so invite yourself inside and rest up Need to make up for months of lack of hydration, so prepare for 5,000 worth of hydrates. Oh, it's true, I haven't process? actually had a it's single sip of anything to drink since the last stream. It's the only time I'm allowed to drink is when hydrate redeems hit. Yeah, I think I remember. Well, I guess you won't get lost in a small village <coughs> like this. Chug too much coffee too quickly. Wrong pipe. <coughs> I'm okay, I swear. <laughs> I can't, I can't yet talk to the barrels. Where did I put it? I need to make a habit of taking things out of the container before I forget.
Uh, let's see. I really like this flyer here. Don't drown the owl? I'm okay. You can take whatever you want. Just play with me later. That's my response to, like, home intruders when I was a kid. Like, people would break in and I'd just be like, yeah, just take whatever. But, like, I don't know. Just... You want to, like, you want to play, like, F-Zero or something? Do you, do you want to see RuneScape? I, ha I have a RuneScape account. Mr. Glide, I've been telling you that I won't get in the way of your work. Side note, but someone has been sticking googly eyes to your university vending machines? Very important. All I'm saying is that I want to get a little peek at the ruins. They understand laundry and taxes. You just don't understand, do you? It's dangerous in there, so I can't let you in. Women and children need to stay out. Being a woman has nothing to do with this. Oh, excuse me for reason. Okay, but she's kind of cute. Besides, I saw a girl. Her outfit is like ago. really, really good. Oh, Regina, she's like a guy. Also, I like her hairstyle a lot. She's a seasoned prospector. It'd be a different story if you were gonna train your body and become a prospector. What would a missy like Prospector? I hardly know her. She, she seems pretty forceful. Just... I want a pet panna so bad. Whoa! Ah! What's up with this cow? Hannah can do whatever they want. I guess I'll never enter the ruin like this. But I'm sorry. Hannah is extremely fond of delicious grass. Mm. Guess it can't be helped. I'll come back later. I'm gonna take a nice long look around the inside of this ruin next time. Exactly. Let Panna feast. I won't let you in. No matter how many times you come back, you better believe it. Oh my goodness. He said believe it from the hit anime Naruto. His cosplay could use a little bit of work, but, you know. Alright, we've got a little bit more exploring we can do here. Oh no, I explored in the right direction by mistake. I am a fool. It is hey, me, I'm Boo Boo the Clown. Like, almost a year? Probably. It's been around that long since you came to visit me. And so why are you going on this journey? Peddling medicine? How can I say this? I'm looking for rare flowers. Rare flowers? Are you gonna I can't believe this. I went in the right direction. All is lost. No. I don't know if you'll believe this or not, but... In fact, you did it so fast, I thought you did it on purpose. See, the thing is, is that would be assuming that I do anything on purpose instead of just blindly doing things and hoping for the best. Okay, then. I'll help you. 
Thank you very much. I know this kind of story is hard to believe. But just you saying that makes me happy. So, the clues that will help me find Neo are these glowing flowers. This is one of my favorite Atelier moments. I should just tell Regina this outlandish story and Regina's just like, okay, sure, you wouldn't lie and goes to help. But the thing is, is like, that's how it be. Glowing like, if a friend so shows up at my door oh, and is like, hey, I need help. The Fae kidnapped my little sister. I'd be like, I right, fam, I'm, I'm coming. Give me just a second to get my jacket. It's what makes Atelier such a comfy series. It starts writing characters from the assumption that they're all good people, which is rare. See, that's one of the things I like about it, is, like, the characters are good people. Like, some people will do, like, bad things. But, like, for the most part, like, I don't know. It's just a fundamentally, like, hopeful-seeming franchise. And I very much like that sense of hopefulness. It's something that I really hope to capture with monster parcels as well. He likes rare things and collects various items as a hobby. As a patron of rare things, he might know something about rare flowers. Um, could you please introduce? Yeah, sure. I was gonna go to feed. You are not a bad person. Anyway. Out of here with that. All right. If that's our plan. I'll hurry and get ready for the journey. You're right. You'll probably need to pack some stuff. You are my dear daughter. Oh, that reminds me. Aisha. Didn't you bring too much stuff with you? You look more like you're moving away than going on a journey. Too much stuff? This is just the snacks for the road. <laughs> and this is after I tried cutting back on the luggage. I've never been on a journey before. Why don't you leave the things you won't need here? Huh? At your house? But... Are you sure? Yeah! I have plenty of space anyway, so feel free to use it like your own house! Thank you very much! Then, I'll take advantage of your kind offer! I'll just put my cauldron down here for a moment. What? Aisha? You were carrying that thing around? You can't leave the house without your cauldron. I don't think you need that on your journey. We do need that on our journey. Huh? Really? But I start to get restless without my cauldron. No, no, no. It's not like a pillow or anything. Normal people don't carry these around. Okay, real talk though. Whenever I go places, I do usually like to bring my pillow with me. I have trouble sleeping without my pillow. Just leave it here. Panna must have had a tough time. Okay, I'll do that. I'm happy I'll get to synthesize at your I have house. a tough time sleeping normally, for that matter, but like... <laughs> I can't sure sleep without my pillow, and I can't sleep without hugging something. Anyway, I'll be looking forward to spending time with you, Aisha. Our house now. Hotel pillows are somehow always wrong. It's so true though. It's just not, it doesn't work. You can now access synthesis container system menu and journal from Regina's house. From now on, more places where you can access synthesis container system menu and journal may be added. Use them well according to your purpose. A character that can join your party has been added. Recruited members can go with Aisha on her journey. These friends can join you in battle and help you in gathering. You can take a maximum of two friends. Talk to characters in town and select recruit to have them join your party. Select part ways to part company. Bah. Hiya, Jay. Alright. Let's see here. 
Ah, here is our little workshop section. Let us save. Ah, Totsugeki. For some reason, the redeems have stopped working, so I'm just gonna... One of these will be it. Any, any, any day. Any day now. Ah. <sighs> I did it. I toad sued the Geki. We do not have enough memory points for that one yet. Ah, I feel like a sneeze coming on, but it's like not... Totsugeki redeems have such great value right now, they really do. did it. We made ourselves a delicious, nutritious, highly explosive flame aqua with the power of dirt. Uh, let's see. Do we have costumes for other people yet? I guess not. Mm -hmm. All right, so what are our other goals? We got to go to Fierzeburg. I know this is all happening really fast, but I'm counting on you, Aisha. Huh? Regina, did you want me to do something? Remember what I told you? That I had to go to Virzeburg? That thing. Well, technically, it's more of a favor from Hannah than you. I got lucky at the ruin recently, and I want to take what I found to Virzeburg. I know it's a big favor, but would you be able to have Panna carry this? How about it, Panna? Is that okay? This is it. This is my moment. I get to voice Panna. Oink! Moo! There we go. Perfect. Also, berries. Also, I have plans soon, so I gotta head out. Gotta have... Blah, 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 blah. Have a great stream. I will have a great stream. And you have a good whatever you were heading out to do. Bye-bye, cat! Now that that's done, Regina, go ahead and stack your stuff on top of her. Thanks, but I'm impressed that you can carry on a conversation with a cow. And this village doesn't have anything, but feel free to get some rest. I recently got a new pot, but it doesn't feel quite right. You'll get used to it sooner or later, don't worry. So you're the apothecary from the east. I owe a great deal to your grandfather. Also, I'm not sure that I would call those abs. Like, there's definitely some definition there, but like, those aren't abs. That's off limits. We won't be responsible if you get attacked by a monster. Carrying these heavy things every day, you'd get stronger even if you didn't want to. I'm cutting stones. It's hard to build with them if they don't have the right shape. 
restricted area. There's so many barrels here. I'm fine, no matter how high it is. As long as I don't look down. One thing I really like with um, the memory point system is it really does encourage you to like talk to everybody and investigate everything. Which is how I like to play games anyway, but like this gives even more of a uh, reason to do so. Alright, let's see what our plans are here. Okay, yeah, we just gotta go to Viersburg. I think I talked to everyone. Okay, yeah, I did go in there. Well, this is a long trip. A very long trip. Hi, Wahaha! Wow, so many flowers are blooming. I don't know if the soil is fertile, but this place is like this all year round. Places like ba -ba. this are rare nowadays. Do you think we can find some medicinal herbs? I wouldn't know what to look for, but... Looks like there are some around. Is it okay if I gather a few? Sure. We're not in too much of a hurry. And so many things are growing here. Thank you. Wow, where should I start? You're looking pretty lively, Aisha. All right then, Miss Regina shall give you a hand. When you have your friends with you, they may help you gather at gathering spots. The items they collect are displayed in the log, like Aisha's, but are automatically put into your basket. Also, your friends have a forte with different gathering spots, and their gathering rates will differ as well. Sometimes, they may obtain rare materials that Aisha can't gather. You should search different gathering spots with your friends. There may be materials that can be found later on. Check the gatherable items from the information on the world map. If you're missing items, go investigate. Dang, I would hope my friends would also help me at a gathering spot. True, though. Whoa, he looks like he's about to... What should we do? Should we run away? Nope. If you can't reason with your opponent, you just have to use your fists. Come on, let's get this over with. Yes, she uses a pickaxe. Good. In a battle with allies, you can gain an advantage by supporting each other. The support gauge will increase with each action taken. You can support your allies when the gauge is full. This action is called the active command. Your AC is executable when certain conditions are met. These conditions depend on your support gauge being full and on your target's position. When an active command is available, buttons will pop up. Press the displayed button to execute the support effect. Each effect depletes at a certain amount or depletes a certain amount of your support gauge, and some may even use one or two gauges. Use the active command to protect a character from taking damage or defeat all enemies at once. Use these features to turn the tide of battle in your favor. Okay, let's get this started. Bonk. Pickaxe is cool, but is it cooler than a bazooka? Yes. Okay, as a melee weapon improves it slightly. What skills do we got? Guess I should give it a shot. 
That was called Double Smash, but it hit three times. Time to gather. Imagine if Bazooka was also a pickaxe? Uh, that's just Blaze Reap from Maiden Abyss. There's another point. All right, onwards we go. Oh, be careful where you step. The floor falls out sometimes. What? Is it like a trap or something? No, no, it's just an old tunnel. So it shows its age in places. But a group of us went around restoring it, so I think it should be okay. Just as long as you didn't bring anything heavy. A heavy? That describes Panna to a T. That's very rude. Panna is perfect physical condition, but all five trillion things that you have stacked on top of her, however, add a little bit of weight. Hmm, I wonder. I think this much will be okay. Panna is a girl, too, so I'm sure she doesn't want to be called heavy, right? See? See, Aisha? Right, Panna? Aisha's so mean, huh? Oh, Pada, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it that way. Oink, moo. Kind of hurts my throat. Maybe I don't want to actually exclusively voice things like Pana. This is such a large passage. I wonder if the people of the past made this. Eh, who knows? Sure, it was a tunnel to transport things, but they must have gone through a lot of trouble to make it. You're right. It's amazing how they just carved out the inside of a rock-hard mountain. Actually, the materials that are used in this passage themselves would make me good money. With just this one pillar alone, I could live work-free for at least five years. But, but you can't! If you took the pillar, wouldn't the passage fall? Yeah, no doubt it'd fall. But... Then we wouldn't be able to get away safely. Stop it. I'm not planning on taking this pillar. I'm just saying that if there's any part I could take away, that'd be it. Let's not do that. Do not watch my stream while driving, Chaika. That is very dangerous. Or audio only at the very least. Anyway, <laughs> uh, I guess I shouldn't think about striking it rich. That's right. Steadily, little by little, is the best way. It's just aiming to strike it rich is the best thing about being a prospector. I need Belle here to scream we're rich at the top of their lungs. On second thought, just one pillar won't. Uh, Regina, stop! I don't want to fall! Oh, those little icons for the gathering thing are so cute, actually. I just looked at them. More barrels. These are wild barrels. Free range. Ah! 
There's a flyer, let's see. Whenever you come by, new discoveries and delights await you at Harry's Trading House. Harry's Trading House provides high quality products at unbeatable prices. Sale, sale, sale! To our loyal customers, temporary sale! Take a look. Over the course of several dusks, in order to survive, people learn to come and govern. Together. That was a very suspiciously long pause there. Cutscene. built upon the freedom of a government of the people. A place <laughs> where they really took their time with that one. Wow! So this is Fierzeberg. There are so many magnificent bridges. It's amazing. Well, let's go our separate ways from here. I have a delivery to make. Okay. What should I do? This is a good opportunity for you to just wander around. Just wandering around? My favorite. I'm sure there's a lot of things in this town that you've never seen before. Sightseeing. That does sound fun. My friend's shop is just up the hill, so let's meet up there. Sorry I'm making you wait around, but I'll introduce you to the person I was talking about. The hill. How do I get there? Oh, you just go up the hill. If you head down the street that you'll see when you enter the town, and just keep going, you can't miss it. <laughs> I'm still pretty confident that I can get lost. You'll be fine. But if anything does go wrong, let's meet up at this bridge. Um, even with that backup plan, there are so many bridges. Oh, right. Well then, the hill it is. If you get lost, just remember to keep going up. Okay, see you later. Oh, we can't talk to these people. Wow, I wonder what's going on. There are so many shops. Are they having some kind of festival? I'm here. Maybe I should go buy some souvenirs. Huh. I wonder which way is oh, no. up the hill. I have no clue. Could I have gotten lost? Aisha is the least directionally challenged protagonist. Oh, no. No, no, that's... That's a different trilogy. Th this is Dusk. Huh? This is... The smell of a witch. Will thou... A witch? I haven't even played this trilogy and I love Will Bell. also a sweet scent. Is that the smell of candy? you it won't do you any good to hide it you have sweet candy on you don't ya want to give me some candy sure again i go. need a witch hat <laughs> thanks it's so yummy you do you should send me a picture i want to see Alchemists 
are nothing but copycats of witches after all. Oof. Throwing shade. Oh, thanks to the candy. See ya. Will Bell really just went, oh, I didn't realize that you were a copycat peasant. Anyway, thanks for the free stuff, sucker. Bye. Oop, I didn't mean to walk backwards. I wanted to go to that shop, but... I'd like to take you up the hill, but I'm sorry, I hurt my knee. Is this your first time in this town? Well, take your time and enjoy it. Can I barge into people's houses? I can't. Uh, to get up that hill, just go straight down this road. I'm sorry, no can do. I can't go straight down the road. Now, Sapphic down the road. I can do that. That's easy. Sorry to keep you waiting. Well, let's go. Yeah, so the person who's knowledgeable about flowers is around here. Yeah, the owner of Harry's Trading House is the odd fellow who likes strange things. He might know something about the flowers you're looking for. Oh, then let's go see him right away. I know I shouldn't say this after guiding you all this way, but don't expect too much. Also, keep an open mind when you meet him. O okay. Gina. Not a huge fan of the series, but Gust always has sick music even back in the PS2 days. The soundtrack is a goat, and I am a huge fan of the series. Hey, is Harry here? I wanted to see him. So you're here to see him. Well, actually, she's the one who wants to see him. I'm Aisha Altugal, an apothecary. It's nice to meet you. I don't know what instruments they're using for this song, but I'm kind of digging it. I feel like I've heard that name somewhere. Could you be the person who made this bitter medicine? Oh, I did make that medicine. I'm sorry it's so bitter. No, don't apologize. Your medicine is really popular. Some people even travel pretty far just to buy your medicine from us. I was wondering what kind of person made this medicine, but who knew she would be so young and cute? Uh, huh? Is it everybody just gonna hit on Asia? Sent the pic to Discord. It's night and didn't feel like turning on my light in the room, but I hope you can see the plushie clearly enough. I will check right now. Oh, that's cute. There isn't a single ugly character in this game. Where's my UB rep? Uh, Ultra Beasts are in Pokemon Sun and Moon. That's where you're looking. Aisha, you're playing right into Marietta's hands. <laughs> I guess I should formally introduce myself since such a cute apothecary came all this way. I'm Marietta, the shopkeeper of this store. Also, Aisha is a JRPG protagonist. She's going to get hit on by everyone. True. If you need anything or have anything you want to talk about, feel free to ask anytime. Oh, yes. Pleased to meet you. So, Marietta, we're here to see Harry. He's here, right? Oh, that's right. Hold on. I'll go get him. Every song in this game has me bopping my head. 
Well, well. <gasps> More books. I hope I didn't keep you waiting too long. You see, I am a busy guy. Whoa. He's very... flamboyant. I am the Commercial and Industrial Association Assistant Vice Director, Recent Gang Government Chairperson, President of the Occasional Rare Item Enthusiast Society, and the organizer... I like this guy already. Treasure. Yes. I am the famous Harry Olsen. Now then, when you're as famous as I am... He makes me think of uh, Varric from Avatar. House. How troublesome. Even so, I promise not to mistreat you. I'll willingly give you an autograph. It is, after all, part of my mission. Like, he just has those vibes, you know? Um, thank you very much. Hey now, that's not it. We came here to ask you a question. Aisha, if you don't want it, you definitely have to tell him that you don't want it. Anyway, we have a question for you. Harry, you're familiar with weird stuff, right? I have been asked this exact question before. This People have just been like, hey, flowers. Avery. You're a weirdo. You would know the answer to this. And I'm like, oh, thank you. Um, also, yeah, I do. So, you know. I, I guess you were right. Hmm. Flowers, you say? Well, flowers are my field of expertise. Well, every field is my expertise. Come now. Ask me anything. Okay. Um, it's about this flower. Would you happen to know anything about it? Oh, this is... Hmm. Uh, I, I see, I see. Got it. This is... That. That? It couldn't you know possibly be... It? That. <laughs> I told you earlier, my knowledge in the field of science is wide and deep. There is absolutely nothing that I don't know about. However, it's right on the tip of my tongue, but its name escapes me. I seem to be suffering a so-called memory lapse. That seems kind of suspicious. Harry, you seem to be sweating quite a lot. What? Are you accusing me of lying? Still no, we're just like telling, we're accusing you of not telling the truth on purpose. I'm sorry, but would you please give me some time? I'll try to remember it. So you're trying to buy some time and plan to do some desperation research? Um. Uh, of course not. I told you, there's nothing that I don't know. Well, whatever the case may be, I don't mind. We'll come back later. Sorry, not necessarily to make up for it, but you're welcome to freely use a spare room while you wait. We're grateful, but how many days do you plan on taking to remember? Huh? Oh, one or two days. Otherwise, one or two weeks. Either that or. Okay, uh, okay. Do your best to somehow. Harry's pretty good. Research it. We're counting on you. Yeah, hair gradients are good. I'm a man who never betrays your expectations. Now, why don't I go ahead and take you to the room you'll be using during your stay? Oh, are you sure? You should take him up on this kind offer. Staying at an inn would get expensive. Being helpful and looking after people is Harry's strong point. Okay, then I'd like to accept that offer. Ah, the incompetence just makes my heart all flutter. We do love a good dweeb in this house. not that big of a deal. I have plenty more rooms just like this one. Think of this as your own house and feel free to use it. 
just there's just Ooh, a spare room, you know? And the looseness of your purse strings are exceptional, as always. Oh, getting praised like that is making me blush. Oh, goodness gracious. You said your name was Aisha? I'm sure coming here from the countryside couldn't have been that pleasant. I believe Marietta told me that you sell medicine? In that case, you're somewhat connected with my store. There's no need to hold back. Okay, I'll use this room. Thank you so much. No, no, I'm happy to help a young apothecary. If you have any worries, feel free to come talk to me. Goodness, Harry sure can't be helped. He said he was going to try to remember, but I'm sure he never even knew. Whatever the case may be, it's hard to hate him, so don't feel bad, okay? Of course not. I really hope it's okay that he lent me this room. He is a dweeb, but again, it's great. I love me a good dweeb. Harry was a total miss, but you were able to borrow this nice room. So Dang, I wish I could have a room like this. With like three sets of quotation marks around rooms. It has a staircase. People that's not a room, that's an open floor rooms. plan, two-story so apartment. Place to search for things. You're right. Although I'm still not sure where to start. Glowing flowers and clues about Neo. I need to find them, no matter what. Regina, I'm gonna overcome any challenge that comes my way. I'm sure I'll find clues about Neo somewhere. Yep, you can do this, Aisha. I'll do my best to help you. I just intended to walk around after this job was done anyway. Feel free to depend on me whenever you want. Wow, having you with me will be a great help. Regina? The clown nose noise. A map for the area around here. I saw it in the room, so I brought it with me. We need to know what's around before we can start searching. Oh, a map. I don't know anything about the area outside my I keep workshop. yawning. I'm not even tired. I guess I have to start by looking around. That's right. I think this will really help us out. Also, asking the people around town might be good, too. Okay, I'll do my best. New workshop get. Oh no, we're having... We need more memory points. Hoi, how are you? I am well, thank you for asking. Uh, let's see, what's on the second floor here? Genuinely, I could live in this is my entire house, no pro- This is so nice. You got space for your cauldron. You got plenty of bookshelf space. Oh, we can make bread. Is this okay? You should press X on your controller or whatever you have for the far left button of the four buttons. You can see what makes a memory give stuff and what also gives bonuses once you complete them. Yeah, no, like this place is huge. Let's save again while we're at it.
The X button didn't seem to do anything. Was quickly running around the edge of the room to uh check for materials. Oh, I just remembered that I have to buy more synthesis ingredients. I'm sure I'll need medicine one way or another from now on. But hmm. Maybe I need to look for jobs around here, too. Let's see, I currently have... Huh? I, I don't have it! Where's my wallet? Uh-oh, we've got a case of the poor. She's just like me, for real. Uh, the sprint seems to be a toggle. But I'll see if I can get the, uh... Good old tales of stutter step going. <laughs> Miss, are you in trouble? Oh, aren't you that weird girl from before? Don't call me weird. You're in trouble, right? I'll help you. So just I love the big floopy wrong. sleeves. shopping and then about how I needed to find work. Look at how smug she is. So I went to check how much I had and I couldn't find it anywhere. Okay, that totally didn't make any sense. Just calm down a bit. Oh, okay. I'll calm down. I think I dropped my wallet. Your wallet? Hmm, I see. So, you're clumsy. From how you looked before, you were probably spacing out and dropped it. Uh, yeah. Maybe you're right. What should I do now? Who should I talk to? <laughs> you're in luck. <laughs> huh? Even though I dropped my wallet? Yep. Because searching for lost items is my forte. Magilu is a very good smug weirdo witch. I'll find it in no time with my magic. Magic? Well, whatever the case, please find it. Leave it to me. Okay, then. What? Your hand? What do you mean, what? Payment. Jeez, you're slow on the uptake. Pay in advance. 50 coal. Huh? You're charging me? Of course. This is how I support myself. But we don't have any money. So you go around finding things for people? How admirable for someone as small as you to be working already. That's not all. In a town this big, a lot of people have problems. And I just use my magic on the down low to solve them easily. I see. That's great. I end up making good money. If you need money, why don't you try it? Uh, enough of this talk. My payment. Oh, right. About that, everything I own is in my lost wallet. So I have zero money on me right now. You're so clumsy. You should carry at least two. At wallets. least two wallets. And that's the minimum precaution. Uh, I don't know anything about these things. Me, I, I have forty on. wallets. Fine. It's your first time, so I'll do this one for free. Really? Oh, thank you very much. That I keep them all in my wallet piece. wallet. Okay. Otherwise okay. known as my Leave purse. Um, where did I put it? Hmm. Huh? Was it I guess here? technically I do actually have multiple yeah. wallets. Because I have like a little My Neighbor Tododo wallet that I keep in my purse. But then I also have an owl with a little zipper on it that I use as like a coin purse, and you could kind of call that a wallet. Oh, here it is. Here you go. Huh? What do you mean, huh? This is yours, right? Y yes, it is. But why? It was on the ground over there a few moments ago. It's freshly picked up. Oh, I was gonna look for the owner of that lost wallet and get money out of them. But this time is a special case. Make sure you thank me a lot. She's only a child, but she's already working. 
How admirable. I mean, working. She pretty much just said, I use my magic to scam people by making it seem like I put more effort into solving their problems than it actually takes. And then overcharge. Most of the problems people in town have are things that can be solved by giving them synthesized items. Some problems may even specify material items or item categories, not necessarily a specific item. By satisfying certain conditions with the items you give them, it'll be easier to solve their problems. It's up to your playstyle to either solve the problem by meeting or the conditions through quality or quantity. There are time limits to the rewards. If you go over the limit, your reward will be affected. Conversations in town can be viewed again by accessing the notes. If you're unsure of what item to prepare, check out the notes. It seems like he caught a cold. I heard the anti-sick powder is really effective. Uh, so we need anti-sick powder. I really like the usage of the fl like flyers for this. This trading town has developed under self-government for hundreds of years. Any traveler should definitely visit it once. The humans and other creatures of this region gather, gather in Virzeburg. You'll probably find anything you're looking for here. Let's live a life full of the few pleasures this world has to offer. In the booming marketplace, an exhibition of rare exhibits is held. Here begins the most marvelous memories of your lifetime. Hey, do you know about wax? It's really fun. I wish I had some to play with. White wax is so pretty. As you get older, your skin gets rough. I'm looking for pressed oil since I heard it's good for your skin. Oh, me too. <sighs> I should have taken better care of my skin when I was younger. The trick is just do not get any sunlight at any point whatsoever under any circumstances. That's why I have perfect skin. Okay, so... Talk to this guy first. Okay, so that brings us back to the Bizarre Street. That also brings us back to Bizarre Street. And so does that one. How bizarre. And so does this one. Alright, so let's see. What do we got here? We need anti-sick powder, pressed oil, and wax. Let's at least get our base synthesis out of the way to have made everything kind of once. Yay! It's done! Because it looks like a lot of these things we don't know how to make yet. some decent memory points there, though, that we just got. Okay? Alright, let's see what we get from this. Okay, so that's all we can make for now. 
But we do have our memory points. To find someone who might know about Neo, I left the workshop for the first time in a while. I was really tired and I couldn't have made it without Penna. Thanks! When I reached the village, I unexpectedly ran into Regina. Regina and I go way back. Oh, that reminds me. I didn't make any plans about where to stay. Regina said I could stay with her, so I did. I told her about the glowing flowers, and she said someone who knows about strange things lives in Beersburg. Regina will introduce me to that person, so I'll leave my things at her place and go to meet that person. Uh, I'm really relying on Regina a lot. Regina's very reliable, so I just keep relying on her. With Regina's information, I'll definitely find a way to save Neo. And now we should be able to make Artisan's Whetstones. But we don't have any polish powder. Hmm? No, this is itchy. Are these all the stall applications? Yes, Master. All is going as well as we could hope. Hmm. They've certainly increased, just as I had planned. I don't mean to praise my own success, but it's certainly proof of my innovative spirit. Hmm? I don't mean to praise my own success, but I am the best, and a genius, and good-looking. Also, I am impeccable in everything I try. It really is quite amazing how amazing I am. But, you know, in a humble way, not to, not to brag. Oh, geez, I've been so busy with all the preparations. Huh? Oh, well, if it isn't Aisha. He's such a dweeb. See, I'm rushing around like there's no tomorrow with all these preparations. My goodness. Uh, um, is something um. about to start? Oh, it's a good thing you ask. We're in the process of preparing the bazaar. Bazaar? Never heard of it. It sounds bizarre. It's like a flea market that's held every month. And to be quite frank with you, it was my idea. Every month, for a few days, we open a market where anyone is welcome to sell their goods. I didn't even need to make the pun. I was gonna make the pun, and then I saw that the dialogue was already doing it for me, so I just added the wink. Various items are gathered from all four cardinal points. There will be sellers from distant places that you've probably never been to, with participation continuing to grow. It has certainly reached great prosperity and popularity. It's a victory for my planning ability. Wow, that sounds fun! It's almost like a festival! That's right! It certainly is a festival! I flatter myself with my own overflowing business talent! The bazaar starts on the tenth day of every month. By all means, drop by! You may even encounter some unexpected lucky finds! Okay! I'd love to join in! In Beersburg, a market called a bazaar will periodically be hosted. Various people will open shops in the bazaar. Some shops will only be open at this time. You may find rare items. The bazaar will be held every month from days 10 to 19. It will be good to reside in Beersburg during this period. Your friends may open shops. This could be a good opportunity to further deepen your friendships. You can now use shortcuts. Press right bumper to choose where to go and you will be teleported there. You can use the shortcut feature to get back to the world map. If traveling between areas to consume time, you can use shortcuts. <sighs> I thought I wouldn't have to deliver the flyer paper until later. How can I get pulp paper now? Well, have we got the deal for you? The, the hold that thought. Hold hold that thought. We'll be right back. We need more paper. Yay! It's done!
now then. Easy money. Ah, there's a flyer. Let's see. Whatever you are looking for, you'll find it here. The Bazaar Announcement. The Bazaar is a market with a lineup of the most famous products from all over the world. It's fun for merchants and travelers. I came here to prepare a tool for a journey, but there's nothing here. If only I had a beast repellent scent bag. Have I got the deal for you? And an eagle feather. And we're racking up that good old memory point. It'll be a good number of days before the bazaar is held. Well then, here's the payment. Thank you for the service. No, no. Thank you for your patronage. Oh, that's right. I have one sad bit of news for you, Ernie. Sad? Is it like a business cancellation? Nope. If I did that, my shop would be in trouble too. Literally, somebody's like, oh, if only I had a scent bag. And then just like, you know how Majima in uh, Yakuza will just like pop up out of a trash can? It's just Aisha doing that. It's about that girl who always makes the medicine. She's going to stop making medicine for a while. Huh? You mean Aisha? How do you know that, Marietta? Well, we've become acquaintances. She's a lovely girl, don't you think? Ernie, you're a smoother operator than I thought. Don't tease me. Aisha's like a little sister to me. Oh, I still think that's suspicious, but okay. And about her business closure. She's gonna be traveling here and there. I heard there's something she wants to find. That reminds me. I think she left a message at her workshop. So she did close her business. I wonder where she could be right now. She could be anywhere. She could even be in this very room. Oh, Ernie? Uh, Aisha, what are you doing here? Oh, I'm sorry. Long time no see, Ernie. I felt bad for leaving without telling you. <laughs> Don't worry about it. But what happened? Well, I'll be Avery Alexandria in the feathers. It's true. It has been a minute since I've been here in the feathers. Oh, hello, not Ezreal. He does kind of look a little bit like Ezreal at home. Well, lots of things happened. And so I decided they to really just went Neo. like uh, change it a little bit so the teacher doesn't notice huh? for Neo. But Neo is the details yet but as real drawn somewhere. from memory i should do a drawn from memory stream at some point that would be yeah. so fun it's hard to explain wait i really like that idea aisha okay i'm not keeping sure that one in my brain for the are, future but if you say so i believe you if there's anything i can do just let me know What are you guys talking about? He does sound a little bit like Ezreal. What's going on? You know what, Fizz, Fizz. Look up the voice actor for Ernie. I want to know what oh, other sorry. characters well... Ernie here has voiced. This shop sells various ingredients and items for alchemy. You can register synthesized items as products. Registered products will occasionally show up at the shop. However, item categories that can be registered depends on the shop. <sighs> I've been so busy and tired lately. I want to relax with some dry art. That's TOS. Huh, we're gonna need a lot more of these. Is 
she really wants the uh, herb in sufficient quantities, as it were. I'm helping Gramps out on his search for a preservation item. My hobby is to search for things. I'm currently looking for a dried medicinal herb. Well, have we got the thing for you? Okay, let's see what we got here. There's glasses beans. Cow milk, beast meat, tato, salat, basket, mountain bird egg, raisin ointment, beehives, clean water, fragrant staff, twisted pickaxe, fancy broom. Hmm, I wonder who in uh who in this game might use a broom as their weapon type. A sturdy shirt and a Chris. So let's see. Uh, wait, before I spend all my money on book. There we go. Now we can make the anti-sick powder. I was going to check if I could do the uh, Tales of Stutter step. Eh, not really. Go back and buy the beans? Don't worry, I will be buying those beans. I just got to make some of these other things first. Uh, how many of these anti-sick powders did we need? Uh, three. And we need three wax. Hmm, what should I synthesize? So we need meat for the anti-sick powder, which means we'll need to go back to the store. Um... Actually, wait, before we do this, let's see. Uh... Good with liquid, so we'll do that. Stick with the dried root. Is this okay? And make two of them. Sent you something on Discord. It's the Atelier experience in a nutshell. Please put it on stream. Let me see here. Yeah. Yeah, that is kind of just what these games are. Uh, it did not save. Oh, it did. It just saved as like... A not real file format because the file formats aren't allowed to exist anymore I guess they, they just go JPEG large or WebP they do this specifically to torture me yeah there we go Salt. All 
All right, so we got those. Uh, we needed three wax. I hate web pee. I hate web pee. I hate the weird alternative PNG file format that the name is escaping from my brain of. JPEG large. We can't make the anti-sick medicine yet. Um... Wait, no, they weren't here yet. We were... Over here, it was... Where were the kids that needed the wax? They were right here, right? Yeah. Thanks for the money! Okay, now we can go buy some meat. to register these yet. Fine, I will buy the beans. I don't actually need them yet. But I will need the materials eventually. Hmm, what should I synthesize? Alright, so I need some of those, some of these... And some of these. This will get us three of them. Hey! Yay! It's done! Alright, now we can go here actually first. I managed to meet Regina up the hill. She said she'll introduce me to someone who knows about rare items and flowers. So I decided to go right to that person's shop. Regina took me to a large shop called Harry's Trading House. The shopkeeper, Marietta, is very with it. But I wish she'd stop picking on me. The owner, Harry, is weird. Uh, interesting. Uh, now he is a little weird. Unfortunately, he couldn't remember what he knows, but he said he'll try to remember. I'm really grateful for Harry. In addition to trying to remember, he also decided to lend me a room for free. But I can't just rely on the kindness of others. It seems Regina will also help me, whether it's being depended on as an apothecary or finding out about glowing flowers that'll help me save Neo. I have to do my best. We're already on month five, day four of year one. We gotta find out about those flowers before year three. Okay, what else did we need to make here? Let's see. Um, we need pressed oil and then dry herbs with high rating. Let's quickly check what we need to make the pressed oil. Hmm, what should I synthesize? Plant oil and incense, huh? Easy. We'll use these glasses beans that we just got. Is this okay? And level up. Can you synth a burrito bowl? I wish.
Wait, you weren't here a second ago. Talk to me, give me memory points. And here's your oil. Alright, so we got ourselves some decent money, and I think we've cleared up all of the requests here. So, let's get ourselves some gear upgrades while we're here. I'll buy Wilbell a broom for now. Wait, if we equip that, then we can just re-equip this over. This limited. I'll buy it for now. Uh... Dang it, I need more dried herbs. You have obtained search equipment. Search equipment is exclusive to Aisha and provides effects outside of battle. Equip it the same way as any other equipment. Access equip from the menu or search it for it in the basket. Also, please note that search equipment provides traits and passive effects that are not reflected during battle. Okay, that's why. Do that. Do that. And equip the basket. Uh, status. What do we got here? Our basket is pretty full. So let's just quickly, uh, toss all that in there. Yeah, no, the Atelier art styles are always so cute. And we're slowly unlocking some art. Oh, right, she's the one who needed the, uh, herb for, uh, medicinal purposes. Is there anybody on the bridge who has requests for us? It's Dweebus. She's here. Join the party. Join the party. Tugel is a good name. That. You seem pretty interesting. If you need anything, I give you permission to come and ask me. I'm usually in town. I can use super magic, so you definitely want to be my friend. I see. Well, nice to meet you then. See ya. Come to me when you need me, okay? Now, we are complete. Uh, we need to go find her. Where is she? Oh, 
Also, do we have any new memories yet? We do. Also, let's save. Ta-da! Okay, so... Make the herbs? I don't think I have the material on me to... Oh, I do. Okay. Uh, I'm good with liquid. We're pretty low on a lot of stuff here. Though we can synthesize some stuff. So. Is this okay? Barrel? Barrel. Alright, now, this should give us enough to get the quality we need, even if, uh, you know, we're not making the, uh, the good herb, but we made a lot of it, so she's still getting a good deal, you know? New emote idea, Avery Barrel? I should add a barrel two tits to have that oh, chucked at my head. So many people. Hello, Aisha! Are you enjoying the bazaar? Oh, Mr. Harry! I actually just got here. Come take a look! I got some good fish today! You won't see a big one like this too often! Freshly picked mountain vegetables! Only two more left. I want Better freshly picked mountain gone. vegetables. Hey, they have some I used to gather garlic. wild onions all the time for salads, and wild garlic grows around here too. So I used to just go out into the woods and forage for it. Where are you? It's so lively. It's nothing like how the street normally is. <laughs> Everyone says that. What do you think? Are you enjoying it? Yes. Very fun! I've never been to such a lively festival before. With so many people, I'm starting to get a little dizzy. Ah, felt. <laughs> too many <laughs> people, many too people, much. It might be tough until you get used to it. By the way, festival? <laughs> I guess it is something like a festival. This festival has become vital to developing Fearsberg's economy and the circulation of goods and money. We hold this bazaar every month. By all means, have fun! Willabelle's got a shop. Nope, this is my shop. I sell the things I get while I'm traveling or doing other jobs. I see. Whoa, you've got a lot of things that... I don't even know what they are. Oh, really? I have lots of things that are useful for alchemists. They're all legendary status treasures that I wouldn't want to let go, but... My room is getting a little cramped, and I need to make sure I cover my living expenses. I see. Well, having a shop at the bazaar seems like it'd be pretty fun. <laughs> Just buying things is half the fun. You might be right. In any case, how are your sales going? Actually, it's not going so good. Uh, maybe my assortment of goods is too peculiar. Maybe they all look like items that you wouldn't use for daily life. But maybe I can help boost your sales. Oh, are you going to buy something? I'll give you a discount. <laughs> Thanks, Belle. Now, let's see. What you got? 
first things first, recruit. Yes. And now... Mm, she's got wax. She's got ton. Unglazed charm. What does this do? Rock soul. Um, these are all pretty cheap, so I will buy them. And let's see. Equips. Uh, this gives fire resistance and MP. Uh, this just... Eh, I don't really know who needs the MP the most, but I'm going to assume that it's probably the witch. Uh, oh, wait, I didn't need to go to Harry's room. I needed to go to... This. Here you go, we got that good good for you. Now we should be able to venture out from town. Oh, Aisha, welcome. Huh? Regina, you have a shop too? Yep, to earn some pocket money. Stall regulations are very lenient here. Oh, I see. I assumed registering for a shop would be complicated. Harry's the one in charge, and he's not too nosy about the details. That's one good point about him. Anyways, I'll have a shop out every month, so come by and stop by when you feel like it. Okay. Oh, but I don't want to get in your way by talking to you too much. Well, talking's part of tending a shop. Customers attract more customers. Oh, I can kind of see that. You'd want to check out a shop if a lot of people are there. Right. So I'm fully open for some chit-chat. Even then, I still won't get that many customers anyway. How many customers do you get at a shop like this? Well, it depends on the day, but it's not that much. But maybe by the time I finish up, I can have a nice meal and a nice drink. So I guess it might not look like much, but getting to enjoy nice food and drinks while taking a break, being able to chat like this and get to know more people, that's enough for me, I guess. Wow, that does sound fun. Well, so, come stop by Regina's shop every now and then, please. What you got? What you selling? Uh, heightened power. Polished eye, whetstone, crystal. Okay, but here's the thing. That's five years of not having to work. I'm just saying. Wood. <sighs> Living life day to day is hard. I haven't eaten in a couple of days. I want a baguette. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Oh, I was hoping these would be more people we could talk to for memory point. However, actually, I think probably what I'll do since the game opens up a bit here is I will wrap up here for now. Since I can't go too terribly much longer to begin with. Uh, where's that other equip that we just got? Huh?
<laughs> I don't know where it went. Okay, so we can't do that memory yet. And save. And... Yeah, I guess we still don't have, uh... Oh, wait, we do. We have other options for other characters. I mean, the witch hat's gotta stay on, right? Wait a second. Wait a second. Can we give Wilbell's hat... It doesn't look quite as good on her. We will get glasses eventually, though, and then everybody is getting glasses. Every single person. Even all of you out there in chat. This was really fun. I hope I can join for more streams. I'm not sure what the uh, time frame will be for these, but for at least the foreseeable future, I'm going to try and keep these on Wednesdays, if possible. Um, and given time schedules, they'll probably be vaguely around this time for the most part. Um, because I may as well cover that Sunday stream a little bit while I have the, uh, time real estate here, though I do need to run in just a minute here. But on Sunday, the super secret stream for that is I will actually be starting a tabletop campaign stream featuring one of my favorite tabletop systems of pretty much all time, Ryutama. And that will be set in the Monster Parcels world. We got some initial stuff out of the way, but on Sunday, y'all will get to see the finalizing of character creation and the start of the campaign. So that's going to be Sunday. That So the problem is, is getting the time scheduling for that was difficult because we're in just all different time zones scattered around all over the place. Also, yes, I did, Tarahana. I don't know why I went to like hit you with the full name there. Like, I know I'm your mother, but you didn't do anything wrong for me to hit you with like just full name, middle name, and all go to your room, no dinner. But anyway, um, on Sunday, that is going to be very early in the morning is our planned time. And that will feature Katarja and Hassel and Setestums and Ocean will be joining me as the players for that campaign. And that's going to be a lot of fun. Um, so Ryutama is very much a system that, like, it's what made me really be hungering to play an Atelier game. Because they have a very similar sort of feel to them, where Ryutama is all about travel and meeting people and seeing places and, like, kind of just taking your time. And having, like, big fluffy pack animals like Panna. It's going to be a really fun time, and I'm looking just so very forward to it. So that'll be on Sunday in the very early morning. Uh, at least assuming nothing goes wrong with the scheduling there. We had a bit of a rough time this week getting everybody in place. But we'll figure out the scheduling as things go. And on Wednesdays, we'll probably just stick to this. I might potentially, if I'm able to squeeze another stream day in in a week, um, start trying to squeeze in some art streams here and there, or maybe just some more atelier. However, I will put these here, where if you're not already following me on Twitter or in the Discord or stuff like that, that's where all of the announcements are. So even though I am just horrifically bad at scheduling stuff, you'll at least be able to keep up with stuff there and know when things are happening and going live. However, for now, I should find us somebody to raid. Uh, who is live? Mm, May is live. Maury's live. Nell is live. Uh, hmm... 
I don't know what games they're playing. Let's send you all to... I don't know, I'm so indecisive. You know what? I, I know exactly who we're sending you to. If I can... There we go. It has been so long that I forgot the raid command. I forgot if it was a slash or an exclamation point. But I am going to send you to another dear Harvey VTuber who is currently playing just chatting. But what is the category here? Still not sure what to do, but we're doing the thing. That fits really well with me not knowing who to raid. So I will send you all her way. And hopefully uh, everything goes without a hitch on Sunday. And that'll be early in the morning, Eastern time. So like, if I recall, I think it was like seven in the morning we were planning to start because time zones are a nightmare. But I'll be in the Discord and around on Twitter and stuff like that. I'm really hoping to just be back into the swing of streaming much more lately. I miss doing this a lot and I don't know, it just feels nice to be back and I feel like something just really relaxing to the soul like Atelier is a good option to kind of ease back into stuff. However, I will stop delaying and send you all over that way. Uh, rate message, I will leave up to viewer discretion. And until next time, love you all lots. I'm glad to be back. And until then, oodaloo.